just wanted to give you some updates uh, based on some of the things that we mentioned in our last newsletter. Um, there have been some really exciting developments that we wanted to um, update you on, uh, as well as some prayer points that we'd like to share with you. Um, first of all, we have made some progress with the letting of our flat and have got permission uh, from our mortgage company to be able to do that, and that's really exciting. Um, we now need to find the right tenant and to take that forward, so continued prayer for that situation is appreciated. And also we recently had a Zoom meeting with the office directors in the UK and in Nicaragua and that was a really helpful meeting in thinking about the risks and um, assessing our situation for going in January. And um, provisionally it seems like that will all be good to go uh, from a risk point of view so that's really helpful. Uh, we're looking forward to some uh, security training in October half term where we'll be practicing lots of self-defense moves. Uh, uh, and so, um, yeah, that's the next process in that. Great, thank you, Helen. So lots of people have been asking us what we're looking forward to about going to Central America to work with EMI. What, what, are, what are you looking forward to, Chloe, um, or what are you nervous about? Um, I'm nervous about, I'm looking forward to, but first I'm nervous about, um, um, I have to leave my friends behind and I'm going to have, I have to have pokes then, you know, pokes and pokes. Pokes, yeah, well pokes are what we call injections, so you are better worried about the injections. Um, and also I'm happy, excited about, um, I can go to the beach more times and I get to have, I can make new friends and I get to, um, move to a new home. Yeah, sounds great. What about you, Josh? What are you excited about? Or I'm excited about? about we get to learn about new things about that country. And but what I'm nervous about is the injections. The injections. But yeah. It just goes away after you had it. So some of you have asked us if we could provide a few details for our financial support requirements. So we've produced a few graphics to hopefully summarise that. There's essentially two funds that we're raising for. One is our monthly support costs, and that covers all of our uh, daily living expenses whilst we are out there covering the items that you see coming up on the screen. It's about £4,000 uh, a month. And then there is a one-off fund of about £37,500, which we need as our mobilisation costs, um, which covers the sort of items you see there. And that includes three months of our monthly support costs in advance, which provides us uh, with the buffer to manage cash flow variations. So how much have we raised so far? Well, of our monthly support costs, we have had standing orders being set up or pledges given for just under 40% of our monthly target. And for our mobilisation costs, we again have received um, donations or pledges for just under 40% of our mobilisation costs. So we've been blown away by the incredible generosity of so many people. Uh, we've still got a long way to go, uh, but this month we're targeting by the end of October to have reached 60% of both the targets before Helen hands in her notice at school. Uh, so if you had been thinking that you'd like to give and you were wondering when to do it, then obviously from our point of view, the sooner we can get a feel what funds are coming in, uh, the better, so we can allow for that. Thank you for listening to our October update. And just as a quick summary, these are the things that we'd love for you to continue to pray for. Firstly, for our kids and for all of us as we uh, prepare in this process of transition. Secondly, for our ongoing accommodation and the things that we need to sort out in letting out our flat. Uh, thirdly, for the ongoing COVID situation in Central America and the risk assessment um, ahead of us going. And finally, for our support raising and in particular, that 60% target that we want to uh, achieve by the end of October. That's all I need for now. Are you Bye! Bye. Bye. To give you our um, most recent update. Right, start again, Josh. We've got to just do not like angry boxes. <laughs> <laughs>
Because it's just fun. Okay. Three, two, one. Hello, everybody. Hello there. We just want to. Oh. Seriously, right. Three, two, one. Hello, oh, sorry, mum. Mom. Sorry, mum is not ready. Three. <laughs> Three, two, one. That's all I need for now. <laughs> <laughs>